Hey guys, happy Thursday. Um, yeah, it's been really, really hot for a while now, and today fine cool down, except it just now started to rain. Have you guys noticed that the only time I get to vlog a lot more is when I'm driving in the car because this is the only time that I have me time and feeling comfortable? But yeah, on my way home, nothing exciting. I think I'm gonna make some tacos tonight, um, a quick one. Um, except I don't have any vegetables and I don't feel like going to buy any right now, but it's gonna feel like it's missing something because I love my um, lettuce and tomatoes. I got turkey meat, I got um, taco seasoning. Um, they ran out of the um, Taco Bell one that I always get, but I got the store bought version of it, so hopefully, it don't taste too different. And I got some taco shells. I'm gonna toast that. And of course, I got my tapatio sauce, which I'll put later on in some sour cream. So, whatever. But yeah, it's pouring rain right now. It's 74 degrees. So at least it's under 80. I won't be suffocating. But every day for a while now, it's been so hot in the house. Don't swear it's fine because there's the fan and um, what's that thing called um, where you put through the window it just makes the house really cold um, and in my parents room in my room I just have my fan which doesn't really help because I feel like it's just blowing hot air and I've been taking like double showers I cannot sleep and then like this hot stuffy weather the humidity is high in, here in Ohio and it, oh my god I get such bad hives like it's so uncomfortable and I'm itchy <sighs> so yeah it clears up by the time I get up in the morning but throughout the whole night I'm having bumps in my thighs and my back and my boobs and my belly Ugh, it's so annoying and it's itchy from the heat yeah so stuff in a car right now too but at least it's not like 80 above and the thing is in California it's really hot but it's just nice and breezy it's not like over here but yeah I'll check you guys later maybe I'll show you my taco nothing too exciting um I'm trying to like get things organized again like my room's a mess at the moment for like a whole month yes I'm crazy I'm a messy lady I need to like organize my clothing items um, I'm thinking of selling some and see what I can get um, there's two places I want to go to um, the last time I did that was when I was still pregnant and I got stuff here and there not too much money back but I got something but it's nice to be able to get rid of it um, if not I can always donate but we'll see because that little extra side money is you know a little something something too so yeah, it might rain this weekend because if it does, then I'm going to have to force myself to clean again. And then, um, yeah, I keep saying I'm, I want to rest during the weekend. I want to relax. I want to stay home. But in like the last month straight, every weekend, I've been out. Taking Ava out to the park. There were festivals going on. The zoo, of course. Um, Chuck E. Cheese. Um, and then, you know the water park first time last week with Ava she really enjoyed herself and so did I so I've been like going to new places here and there and looking um, on stuff to do with kids online that's not too expensive you know but uh, most of the stuff you have to pay but um certain places I would never have gone if I didn't have a child in my life because you know I don't have any friends yeah oh gosh what's going on here so I'm kind of thankful that Ava came into my life even though I am a single mom I became a single mom because of this um, but she she makes me so happy I have someone that looks up to me that admires me and drives me crazy but keeps me going every day no matter how depressed or angry I am I have a little mini me that depends on me and trust me and so yeah I just have so much fun spending time with her even though it's so 
hard sometimes depending on Ava's mood and the anxiety because when it's just you and a child with no extra adult help it, it can be very overwhelming um, Ava's not a bad kid but she has her little moments here and there trying to catch her sometimes uh, trying to tell her no and she doesn't like the word no stuff like that so especially when you feel like people are looking but whatever a lot of kids are like that so just 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 do your best i feel your pain mommy's out there who got little crazy kids so i hate this rain too why can't this be nice and sunny and cool and no rain so what is this my thing is stuck Ugh, it's it's gonna feel like forever at home because people drive really stupid when the weather's bad what is it look at look at this oh gosh i should have Turkey's almost done. I'm actually going to add some corn. Give it a little twist and crunch so I don't have any vegetables. Taco meat is done. Add the corn. Super excited. Hey guys, happy Saturday. It's 9.44. My parents left for a ceremony. I just, um, just baking. Oh, A wants to be on the camera. <laughs> okay. Boo. So just bake some like old pizza. Not really old, it's probably like a month old. Um, what brand is it? I don't know, you'll see in a minute. But um, there was a cheese one and there was a pepperoni one. And they're gonna cut up some watermelon. I'm trying to decide what to do. Probably Chuck E. Cheese. Um, it's actually in the 70s today, shockingly. It's been like super, super hot. I thought it was going to rain, but it's, it's very cloudy today. No sun, but it just feels nice. Um, and cut some, got some watermelon too, but it's not as sweet. I was craving for watermelon forever, but it's... Because it was pricey, and yes, I still bought it priced yesterday. It was like $6. I'm like, ew. But take a look. It was very, very juicy, but not as sweet. I have that with Ava, along with the pizza. Yeah. Yummy! Good. Hey guys! Okay, Hi, so didn't get much done today. Um, can't really clean when it's just me and Ava because she wants me to give her full attention and I just don't want to leave her alone downstairs, you know? But, um, uh, but anyway, gonna... we're heading to Chuck E. Cheese and I think I might want to try and check out some stores and stuff. But, you guys, today I'm kind of nervous because today's the first time that I'm actually out without a long sleeve top or some cover up or whatever because I've been so embarrassed about my arm scars from when I was pregnant all the rashes and mosquito bites and I you know I am a scab scratching lover and I've showed you guys this many times so this is like in bear lighting it looks really bad like when I look at it but I don't know see I'm it's just uh, I'm thinking worse the worst of it but it, I mean uh, who's gonna look at me you know but uh, no one really cares like I know that but for me it just it, it just bring my self-esteem down like this is gross but it, it's gotten lighter for the past what it's been two years now so I've been trying to put like vitamin E oil and I use a bio oil I haven't been like, consistent with it but then at times I am lately I've been so I'm actually gonna go get some I think I might get some more bio oil and then also like shea, shea butter or um, cocoa butter or something. I don't know. I mean, is this really bad, you guys? And sometimes I get like bumps here and there and stuff too and it hurts and I, of course, scratch it in the middle of the night. Can I see that? <sighs> okay. So I'm just gonna face my fears and deal with my short sleeve because it's hot, you guys. It's hot. I've seen people with scars and they're not out and about and me it's like ugh. Alright, I am gonna get going. Go, go, Chuck E. Cheese! 